I'm Nicholas Ferroni. And let me start by saying I am just a high school teacher, but I really want to get something off my chest. Robert Griffin III, Peyton and Eli Manning, and LeBron James. You guys are exceptional athletes. Exceptional. But you're also hypocrites. And when I say hypocrites, I don't mean what you do on the field or court, but what you do off of it. You all endorse products and companies that are not only unhealthy, but that are greatly contributing to childhood obesity. And I know you guys aren't the only athletes and celebrities to be doing this, but you're the most visible. And this has to stop. Eli Manning. I mean, you brought two Super Bowls back to New York, which is why now I'm curious on how many donuts and culottes you have, or what your favorite donut is, or how often you bring your family for donuts and culottes. Robert Griffin III. I mean, you won the Heisman. You're one of the most dynamic quarterbacks in the NFL, which makes me want to know, what is your favorite sub sandwich? How many subs a week do you eat? And most importantly, do you prefer your sub with or without the chemical oats found in yoga mats? Mr. Peyton Manning. You are the greatest quarterback ever. You're gonna break every record. Which makes me wonder now, how many of your TD passes would you credit to pizza? And did you eat pizza before or after the playoff games? Or was it just after the Super Bowl? And actually, how many times a week do you give pizza to your family? Mr. LeBron James, the king. My students, they worship you. They'll do anything you set. Which is why now, I have to know, how many times a week do you have burgers, fries, and large sodas? Is it just a pregame thing? Did you just have a burger and fries and soda for the NBA Finals? Because you're wearing your uniform, and based on your commercials, you would think you eat there a lot. So I really have to know. Now, Eli, Robert, Payton, and LeBron, I mean you no know, disrespect, but I'm having a tough time, a tough time believing that you incredible athletes, all in peak condition, eat or drink any of the products you endorse. Because if you did, I don't think you guys would be in peak conditions or would you even be professional athletes. And I have no problem with you taking advantage of your fame and endorsing a wide array of products. But let's be honest, knowing that so many children and young adults look up to you, maybe your commercial should come with some sort of disclaimer so they actually know the truth. I got an idea, how about something like this? No? Or, how about this one? They'll get the idea, right? And again, let me stress this, I am just a high school teacher, but I care deeply, deeply about my students. And I'm, I'm not blaming you guys for childhood obesity, but you're not helping. Who do you think a kid's gonna listen to more? All right, parents don't stand a chance against you guys. You claim to have great respect for the games you play, and, and you do yet you seem to have no respect for the health and well-being of our youth. My students may say my jokes aren't funny, and they may say I give too much homework, and I do. But they know I care, and they would never call me a hypocrite. It's about time you preach what you practice.